Now to a story you'll only see on two. More than a dozen customers of a suburban home remodeling company are out a lot of money, tens of thousands of dollars in some cases. The contractor disappeared, and now those homeowners are turning to us for answers. CBS 2's Charlie DeMar on the window installer and these broken promises. What happened? Where's our money? Jordan and Vicki Kerr were ready to make a major cosmetic investment to their Buffalo Grove home. You were excited? Yes, it was going to look so <laughs> nice. It was supposed to look like this. We saved up for this. It took us five years to, you know, finally do something about it. The Kerrs cut a nearly $20,000 check to Window Depot USA of Chicago, a remodeling company with a network of locations across the country. And they've never showed up? No. Never. We feel like we did the right things, and still here we are talking with you. The Illinois Attorney General now investigating more than a dozen formal complaints filed against Window Depot USA of Chicago. A spokesperson with the AG tells us they're trying to help customers like the Kerrs and corn fines. And that was just that punch to the stomach for myself and my family. The $30,000 deposit Matt Cornfine paid to fix the siding and gutters on his home went down the drain. Since writing the check, no work has been done on his home in Buffalo Grove. We were just like our money back for what we paid for. We paid for services that were not rendered. We stopped by the company's Elk Grove location where it looked more like a construction site than an office. Thank you for calling Window Depot of Chicago. Calls to the local company went unanswered. The value of new replacement windows. We even exchanged emails with the president and CEO of Window Depot USA, but he offered no insight, explanation, or relief for the customers in the Chicagoland area who are now out thousands. The Chicago location is no longer listed on the company's website. It's absolutely terrifying. I mean, to be perfectly honest, my husband and I drained our savings account to replace the siding on our home. Unlike the others, the work on Laura Starr's home in Brookfield was completed, but she has since been threatened with a lien on her home. One of the contractors was never paid by Windows Depot, USA of Chicago. Window Depot took all of our money, but they didn't pay their contractors with that money. So. We are trying to avoid having a lien filed against our home. We're trying to avoid having to pay twice. I just really hope that as many of us as possible can be made whole again. And that really is the same hope for all of the victims we spoke with simply to get their money back. And along with the Attorney General's office, the Cook County State's Attorney's office also taking a look at this case. A spokesperson with the office says they are reviewing this case to determine if any legal action is warranted. We're live tonight in the loop. Charlie DeMar, CBS 2 News. Erica. What a headache. Horrible for those families. Charlie, thank you.